CBS 17 is so excited to be a sponsor of the Salvation Army of Wake County's Angel Tree program ahead of the holidays. CBS 17's digital reporter Chloe Rafferty talked to organizers about why some families need a little more help this year. We just want to give back to what we have. For Megan Hetrick, it's personal. I came from a bad background and it just, I understand where they're from and needing the help. She and her son stopped by this angel tree at Crabtree Valley Mall and adopted a child to buy presents for this Christmas. I know there's people that need to give back in order to get that same feeling I had when I was a kid and all of the help and it's just important. I see his happiness and I want to make sure another child feels the same thing. <laughs> The Salvation Army says their angel tree will help thousands of children in Wake County get the Christmas of their dreams. It comes after a year of inflation and federal interest rate hikes. There's a lot of families who have um, just not been able to work this year for whatever reason um, or because of inflation their bills have gone up and you know groceries have gone up and so their income looks a lot different than it did last year. In case some angels aren't picked, the Salvation Army has a stash of gifts they can pull from to fill the need. But they say it's important Important the angels do get adopted, so everybody gets a Christmas. What comes around goes around, so what you give, you get back, and it's just, it's a great feeling, especially around the holidays, to do something like that. To adopt an angel, you can stop by the tree near the Lego store on the first level of the mall through December 16th. It'll be there during mall hours every day except Sundays. There are lots more angels waiting to be hung up on this tree once a spot clears up for them. For more information on how you can help, Head to our website, cbs17.com. In Raleigh, Chloe Rafferty, CBS 17 News. Go get yourself an angel. Yeah, absolutely.